The push for community nursing, I think, is really important to stress today. For me, community nursing has always been a bit of a, a Cinderella part of the nursing fraternity. People often, when they come into nursing practice, students, when I interview them, new researchers in nursing, they want to do the high technical stuff. You know, on the research side, we have the king being the randomized controlled trial, and I use the word king specifically. And in terms of nursing practice, students often feel that unless they're doing something technical that involves equipment, drips, injections, etc., it's not real nursing. So my presentation is really to put a plea in for what I think is real nursing, which is about the work that we do in the community and the work we do with community individuals and groups. Anyone who's seen me give any presentation to any member of staff in the school knows this quote. This is my mantra. This is the thing that unites community work. This is the thing that unites society, and this is the thing that unites our understanding of why some people have better health chances than others. All animals are equal, but some are more equal than others. That was the time when it was decided that we needed to do something to actually not help the poor, surprise, surprise, but stop the death of the poor impacting on the rich. Some animals are equal, and some animals don't have any equality. I think that how we learn as students, how we experience and how we re respond to health issues, both personally and professionally, actually shape our workforce in health. And it also shapes the communities in which we live. It's not just about what we do as nurses or what we do as tutors training the next generation of nurses at that particular point. It's about the impact politically and socially on our communities and on our profession as well. Nursing is guilty as charged of spending more time looking at the divisions between our own areas of professional practice than looking at what we have in common. Even in community nursing, we determine are you a di what kind of community nurse are you? It strikes me that even with when we look at registration of nurses, we ask, what kind of nurse are you? The way in which we interrogate people, whether they do their nursing in the community, whether they do their nursing through teaching and learning, whether they do their nursing contribution through, through research, reminds me about how we used to discriminate in terms of colour. It's not how black are you, it's how nursing are you now. And if you're an academic at one end, you're not quite nursing enough. And we need to get away from that. It's not history which immobilizes us from action, but silence. And there are so many silences to be broken.